Exciting news. The Broadway premiere of Prima Facie, starring Jodie Comer, has announced its co-producers. James Bierman's Empire Street Productions is leading the team. And joining them are Elizabeth Armstrong, Barbara Broccoli, Keola Productions, Kristen Kasky, Echo Lake Entertainment, Eileen Davidson Productions, Alina Lloyd Productions, Falero House, Film Nation Entertainment, Dale Franzen, Limited, Productions Inc., Holly Anderson Levow, Stephanie P. McClelland, Olympus Theatricals, Rachel Sussman and the Schubert Organization. What a powerhouse team. James Bierman expressed his gratitude and excitement about the producing team and the upcoming show. Prima Facie centers on Tessa, a defense attorney, played by Jodie Comer, who after being attacked, reevaluates the power of the law, its patriarchal lineage, the burden of proof and her own morality. Susie Miller wrote the play, and Justin Martin is directing it. Danny Arlington, who understudied the role of Tessa in the West End premiere production, will be the understudy for the Broadway engagement. Jodie Comer is a fantastic actress who won a 2019 Primetime Emmy Award for her performance in Killing Eve. She has also received two British Academy Television Awards for Killing Eve and Help. The play's writer, Susie Miller, is a former human rights and children's rights lawyer. The show originally premiered in 2019 in Sydney and won multiple awards, including the 2020 Australian Writers Guild Award for Drama, the 2020 David Williamson Award for Outstanding Theatre Writing, and the 2020 Major Australian Writers Guild Award. Director Justin Martin has previously worked on The Jungle and has many other credits to his name. Prima Facie features an original score by Rebecca Lucy Taylor, who is also known as Self Esteem, and her soundtrack album is available on digital streaming services. Bierman welcomed the team, saying, we are delighted to be starting the next step of this play's journey here on Broadway, and I am deeply grateful and humbled to have such a powerhouse of friends, colleagues, and brilliance with me on the producing team. We are also excited to share Prima Facie with New York audiences. It is important to note that the play includes sensitive subject matters such as sex, violence, and sexual assault. So, be mindful of that when planning to watch the show. Overall, it's an exciting lineup for Prima Facie, and we can't wait to see it when it begins previews at the Golden Theatre on April 11, ahead of an April 23 opening. It is set to run for a limited engagement through June 18, so make sure to grab your tickets. Jodie Comer's stunning performance in Prima Facie had earned her critical acclaim and numerous awards. It all began with the Evening Standard Theatre Awards in 2022, where Jodie won Best Actress for her portrayal of the complex, and powerful lead character. Jodie's winning streak continued at the Stage Debut Awards, where she was named Best West End Debut Performer in 2022. She then went on to win the Best Performer in a Play Award at the 2023 What's On Stage Awards, cementing her status as one of the most talented and versatile actresses in the industry. But Jodie's success didn't stop there. The NT Live recording of Prima Facie became the highest-grossing event cinema release ever, demonstrating the enduring popularity and impact of her performance. Fans flocked to theaters to see Jodie's incredible work on the big screen, and the play's success only continued to grow. To top it off, Prima Facie also took the top spot in the 2022 crime movie rankings on Letterboxd, a testament to Jodie's ability to captivate and enthrall audiences with her powerful and nuanced portrayal. As Jodie reflected on her many accolades and successes, she knew that it was all thanks to the hard work and dedication of everyone involved in Prima Facie. From the cast and crew to the fans who had supported the play from the beginning, Jodie was grateful for the opportunity to bring such a powerful and important story to life on stage and on screen. And this coming Sunday, Jodie's nomination for Best Actress in a Play at the Lawrence Olivier Awards has her feeling both thrilled and humbled. She knows that the competition is stiff, but she is grateful for the recognition and eager to celebrate the incredible talent and hard work of her fellow actors and creatives in the industry. Whatever the outcome of the awards, Jodie is grateful for the opportunity to share her passion for acting with the world and to tell stories that challenge and inspire audiences. With her talent, hard work, and dedication to her craft, Jodie Comer is sure to continue making a lasting impact on the world of theater and film for years to come. All right, from Alan Sugar. Yeah, you see me, but I see you as well. Do you know, Do you, know how many you came in here absolutely certain that I was a waste of your time? Do you know how long you last? No more than a week. Well, it won't even last 